What is going on beautiful people? I am Lee Hammock, the diagnosed self-aware narcissist known as mental illness and welcome to another episode of A Narcissist Explains, short edition. Today's episode is going to be about a narc one of a narcissist's biggest fears, the loss of control. Stay tuned, like and subscribe, thank you so much. So one of a narcissist's biggest fears is loss of control. And if you're new here, I'm a narcissist. I actually have narcissistic personality disorder. A lot of people ask me, like, what are the narcissist's biggest fears? What are narcissists afraid of and things like that? Narcissists are afraid of exposure, um, loss of control, and have normal fears just like every other everybody else. But loss of control is near the top of that list, y'all. It just is. Because narcissistic people want to be in control of literally every single every single aspect of their lives and the people closest to them of their lives as well. They want to control everybody's finances, everybody's hopes and dreams, everybody's job situation, everybody's schedules and things like that. And if they lose control of something, if they lose control of their significant other, of their wife or their husband, husband or their kids and things like that they will lash out that's why if you break up with a narcissist or if you discard a narcissistic person they tend to become obsessive with you because they can't stand the thought of not being in control of you so narcissists want to control everything and they fear losing that control so welcome back welcome back welcome back y'all so that video right there was filmed directly after after my therapy session yesterday and that was the conversation out there my therapy session control she's like what are you scared of and we, we narrowed it down to lack of control, loss of control over pretty much anything in my life. She's like, one of the biggest problems that a lot, a lot of narcissistic people face, including myself, is the fear of being controlled by someone or something else. The fear of not being in control of our circumstances because a lot of us, when we were growing up, we didn't have complete control of our circumstances. Like we were di di dictated by other people. Like we were put through trauma. Um, we were abandoned, neglected, and things of that nature. So we didn't have control of our circumstances. So when we grow up, we're looking to control every single thing that we possibly can. Anything that we put our hands on, anything that we put, anything that comes into our lives or is close to us, we want to control. Literally every single thing. So that's why when you're married to a narcissistic person, that's why they want to isolate you away from everybody else so they can control you. So they can control your reputation. So they can typically can control your finances, how you're going to raise the kids and things like this. That's why narcissistic parents want to control their kids because they want to dictate the outcomes of those children's lives and things like that fear y'all and if something threatens that control if something threatens to come into that narcissistic person's life or that toxic person's life and threatens to take control away that's when you get to see narcissistic people lash out they will see narcissistic people become obsessive so they like one 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 easy example to, uh, it, whew, one easy example of this happens when you get uh one easy oh my god i'm sorry y'all i'm watching my daughter right now she's trying to eat so one of the simplest easiest easiest examples of this happens when you're there she go right there if y'all are wondering one of the simplest easy easiest examples of this happens when you break up with a narcissist when you break up with a narcissist when you when you threaten to break up with a narcissist when you discard a narcissist when you leave them they feel like they're losing control over you. So they typically can sometimes will become obsessive. They'll pop up at your house. They'll stalk you. They'll pop up at your job. They'll harass you. They'll blow your phones up. They'll do anything and everything to get you back underneath their control. So narcissistic people are afraid of you know losing control because guess what? Losing control makes you take takes you back to your childhood, to your youthful years when you didn't have control and you don't want to be in that position anymore. So you fear going back to the past when you didn't have control over things like that. So I hope that made sense. Y'all know I had, <laughs> I had a break in the video. I, like I said, I told y'all, I don't cut my videos because I want them to be authentic. I want them to be genuine and things like that. So I don't cut the videos. So you see me parenting, you see me doing it all, you know, all this other stuff. But yeah, I want to control what she eats and make sure she's, she's safe and things like that. So yeah, narcissistic people, when faced with a threat of losing control, typically will lash out of finances, of relationships, of children, anything. Y'all, narcissists want to control every single thing in their lives. And that trying to control too much, it just it overextends that person. So you know, they tend to be have short triggers, short fuses, and things like that. But anyway, y'all, I have to keep these below five minutes. Thank y'all for tuning in to another episode. Like and subscribe for more. And as always, mental illness is out. Peace.